All right, I'm gonna keep going on my streak to see how much more of my queue I can clear out. Now, I just got a warning that the server maintenance is gonna be up within half an hour. I don't think it should impact my gameplay because I'm just accessing my download courses. So I should be okay, but just in case if something happens, if I'm taking too long to finish this video, then, oh my goodness, Nintendo needs to get this stuff together when they get the next version of this game. Anyway, Slippery Noodle. This is by, um, I met, the, I met this guy in person when I went to one of the, um, at the, the locals, and he was really keen on making his own level. So his name's NKV13. This is his first level that just showed up on my list. So we got lots of slips and slides, and it's a 2% clear rate. I did beta test an early version of his level, so I kind of have an expectation of the kind of levels that he likes to do. That being said, I still don't know what to expect. I mean, so far it feels traditional. Lots of coins everywhere. Oh, wow. Make that jump. Slide down here. Oh, jeez. There goes my shroom. Wait. There was a switch underneath there, I, uh, <gasps> excuse me. I'm so used to Mario World having the timer. I keep thinking that the song is giving me like the Adams Family vibe. Okay, you wait, and now it goes on a timer. Oh my god, it's quick. Especially with the slippery slope I have to deal with right now. Okay, jump. Oh my god! That is quick. And I, I can't dilly dally on there either. I have a feeling like I get, I'm gonna slow down there. Only the shroom then, if I have a, a pit to deal with. Alright, there's a good rhythm with that. Alright. I still find it questionable to fit with the theme of this, um, level. Because it's type platforming, it's not exactly slipping and sliding. Oh, jeez. Whoop! Oh, I thought I could make that. That's where I assume a lot of players just gave up because they were not really quick enough to do that. So that should send a light to MKV. But you never know, maybe that's what he wants. Maybe he wants a, uh, a pit of people just to all die. That's all what he wants. It's not exactly what the player wants. The player just gets whatever they can. That was a little slow. Yep. Yeah. I was late on that. The only thing I don't like about icy levels, I don't find the icy physics that much. It's just the slow acceleration to get up to full speed now, because you're finding a lot more- Oh my god. Let me fix that quick. There we go. No one's gonna tell me to go to bed now. Okay, so if someone ever comments on my videos, please tell me this is not Am's family. Now, if you do fail, at least when you get to, like, a third block up there, you can at least stay to the one side and just, like, well, you jump. So that hopefully the block beneath you will catch you by the time it moves around, because it does move that quickly. I'm gonna wait for these guys. Oh, jeez. I expect them to slam into each other. Oh! I can't jump! I... Oh my god, it's, it's one of those... Not, it's not a precise jump, but I can't full jump. I have to short hop it. Well, keep it in mind, remember, dumb up the cranes. I played the level with uh, Cranes from MKV, so he's very picky about those. In terms of making sure 
that you were in the right spot. And you jumped the right way. Like this right here is a, a, is a full hop. It's a dedicated full hop with max momentum. But what's going on up ahead is a short hop with max momentum. So like here, yeah. You can afford to... Not like that, because you get trapped at the top one and then you won't be able to make it later. But you can't afford a jump on the side. I wasn't going to make that. It, it's funny too, because the rhythm of the jump should be able to give me like a good reading on that, but the thing was, I was also slow on my movements. So if you saw, I was like slipping right there. If I just, like the time of my jumps wouldn't matter, I really got to save my money. Okay, it's like, it's not even a short hop, it's like a middle jump. And the majority of the players have not gone this far, so I gotta figure out what to do. It doesn't feel like I can make it, but I still can. So I can it. Oh! Not this time! Oh god, I gotta hold it a little bit more. I don't really have to swing either. Perhaps it's intended for me to swing, but I don't really think I have to. Right there, you ah! more. I gotta hold it more. I don't know why I'm getting these points, they don't carry over. Close enough. The good news is I saw the checkpoint just past the hooks. Oh god. Okay, don't go too early. Even if you think you can make it, you're gonna butt your, uh, bump your head in the ceiling. Christ. Oh! Nice. Easy. Easy. Okay, now I'm going to save my shroom this time. I'm being patient, because I'm given plenty of time in this course. That's fine. If I really want to test myself, I could have access to this level offline, and then just do a hit, a no damage run. Okay, this looks familiar. No, I'm lying. This is not familiar. 
The layout's a little familiar, but the obstacles are not. How far do you go? Stop dilly-dallying! Cheese. You pet macaroni and cheese. Give me that fire flower. I don't know what fell down there. Oh, it's a flame. Okay. There's a couple Koopas. Woo! 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 Oh, jeez. I got the firepower. True. Thank you. It's also pretty speed button friendly, I'll give you that. Okay, there's an end challenge to this now. Maybe not. It's just a nice end. Okay. I like that. Despite the bit difficulty, before the first checkpoint, Even if you think that it's so easy for you, you have to make it so easy for you so that way the difficulty is just right for everyone else. That's how it goes because you can't assume that the people playing are going to be the same masters in Mario as you. That's the big problem. But, well, it's not a big problem for this level, it's just it's an overall problem where there are many people that are making the levels that are adapted to, the, to their level of skill, but they don't account for everyone else. Not to mention, someone else actually played this game and actually beat the record for me. So, something to keep in mind. I can probably replay this again and go for a better record. But that's cool. 